From the Sphere, the 2nd of November 1946, via the British newspaper archive. The last word in, flat irons, the 1,780-ton coasting collier, Mitcham, the Wandsworth Gas Company's new vessel, seen on the Thames at Wandsworth after negotiating the 15 miles of river from the estuary. When she turns round at Wandsworth there is little room for other traffic to pass. The, Mitcham, has a squat funnel to save her lowering it at each bridge, and her collapsible masts are stepped down into the holds. She is equipped with sloping wing ballast tanks, which ensure that the cargo automatically precipitates itself within the range of the mechanical grabs during the discharge operations. The Wandsworth Gas Company are adding several new ships to their fleet. The Mitcham bears a close resemblance to the Chessington, which is nearly 260 feet long, and as she passes under the bridges her funnel lowers in the usual manner and her masts telescope into the holds. The Chessington is equipped with sloping wing ballast tanks which ensure that the cargo automatically precipitates itself to within the range of the grabs during discharging operations. The general layout of the ship is of much improved pattern, and special attention has been paid to the officers' and men's quarters.